Bloemfontein Celtic is the latest club to suffer for the fans' misdemeanors after the PSL finally delivered a sanction following a pitch invasion that occurred during their home fixture against Cape Town City at Dr. Molimeda Stadium earlier in the month. Only 23 minutes of play were possible when the two sides met on Sunday, the 14th of April, when some members if Sivan LASA Mas LA Sale, as Celtics fans are known, threw objects on the pitch, with some making their way to the playing surface in protest against the sad state of affairs at the club. As with similar incidents in the past, the matter made its way to the PSL Disciplinary Committee, who acted swiftly in delivering a verdict and the subsequent sanction. Read Cape Town City FC Bomon PSL refs vow action against Kermit Erasmus no replay. If Bloemfontein Celtic vs Cape Town City match instead of ordering a replay of the fixture, as was expected by some, the league has instead ordered that Celtic forfeit the game to their opponents on the day, awarding City a 3-0 victory. This was revealed in a statement issued out on Friday morning, which revealed that the club had been found guilty of not providing adequate security for the match. The PSL Disciplinary Committee last night found Bloemfontein Celtic FC guilty on charges of failing to provide adequate security and causing the abandonment of the ABSA Premiership fixture against Cape Town City on 14 April 2019. Premier Soccer League The PSL confirmed that the guilty party, who already have to play their next home game in Poliquain, will host clubs outside the Free State for the rest of the Season. How the PSL's decision impacts the log standings ahead of the sanction. Cape Town City were fifth on the log with 41 points and four games left to play. The club is one of only four within a mathematical shot at the league title, and what is pretty much a free three points has no doubt boosted their chances. Now sitting at 44 points, the men from the mother city can get up to 53 points, which is the Exact tally accumulated by the log leading Orlando Pirates so far. However, the Buccaneers' superior goal difference of 17 to City's 12 means it's still a bit of an uphill climb for Benny McCarthy's men, even if the Soweto Giants were to lose both their remaining fixtures. For Fania Sele Sele, the chances at a coveted top 8 finish could be determined by the visit to Thambiza for a clash against 8th-placed Highlands Park. Let's block ads.